Continuing our hip hop history lesson. So then after Drake and J. Cole released a song called First Person Shooter, Kendrick retaliated on a song called Like That by rapper Future. Who's Drake? I told you before, Nanwan, the Prime Minister of Canada used to be a rapper. No way. You're joking. No, really. He was a rapper for like 15 years. I've never heard any of his stuff before. Well, they remixed God's Plan to the trailer for Fast and Furious 19. Oh, that's that song I've heard on the oldie station that my mom plays sometimes. Anyway, so then Prime Minister Drake and Kendrick... Uh, I'm sorry, which Kendrick are we talking about? Oh, Lamar. Kendrick Lamar. President Kendrick Lamar was a rapper too? Yes, Nanwan. Wow. No wonder our two countries are at war. Anyway, so at that point, the president and the prime minister started recording diss tracks to each other. Boo! What, Nanwan? You can't say the word diss. It's a bad word now. Oh, right. Sorry. So um, they started recording insulting tracks towards each other and dropping them on Spotify. On what? Spotify. Okay, now you're just making up words. Oh, come on. Spotify is a streaming service, and it's still around. Nobody our age uses streaming services. That's for old people. Really? What do you use? We use these retro things called iPods, where you can actually store music onto a... I know what an iPod is, Nanwan. Oh, right, because you're old. My bad. <sighs> so anyway, after many, many insulting songs were released, President Kendrick handed Prime Minister Drake the biggest defeat with his song, Not Like Us. Oh, man, I love song. Wait, you've heard of it? Yeah. They not like us. They not like us. They not oh, like wow. us. Oh, wow. This is great. <laughs> this actually gives me hope that you all will actually lead us into the future by... Yeah, it's by Lil Dunghead. He raps it in Grand Theft Auto 6, which uh, just came out last week. No, no, that, that's not what I'm talking about. I can't believe President Kendrick Lamar sampled Lil Dunghead for a song. That's amazing. How would he have sampled a song 25 years before Lil... Dung head came out. Uh, I don't know. A time machine? I told you before, Nanwan, time machines didn't exist 25 years ago. But they exist now. Somebody could have gone back in time, played the little dung head song for Kendrick, and then he recorded his version. Also, how come those two started fighting in the first place? Because Drake didn't like it when Kendrick claimed he was the best rapper on an earlier track with Big Sean. Opera singer Big Sean was a rapper too? <sighs> I really wish our AI overlords would have banned music in 2046.